President police looking for a crew accused of stealing more than $17,000 worth of Lululemon clothing. And we have just learned they hit again this afternoon. Take a look at this video of the theft. CBS 47's Justin Lum joins us live now in the studio with more on the investigation. And Justin, say police say these suspects, they don't believe they're from Fresno. Yeah, Catherine, like you just said, we just learned these suspects came back to the store this afternoon and stole more merchandise. A witness tried to stop them and got a hold of one bag. Detectives believe this crew of three young women are from the Bay Area and responsible for at least a dozen more thefts at Lululemon stores up north. All told, the heist combining for more than $130,000. Now, you're watching what went down on Sunday afternoon at the Lululemon store at the Fig Garden Village. You see three young women quickly walk into the store and no time is wasted. They start loading up their bags with leggings. After taking stacks of merchandise, they just walk out. The police say they drove off in a car that is in the process of being identified. Now, take a good look at the suspects. Police say the three women are in the age range of 18 to 24, 5 foot 4 to 5 7, and have slim builds. I asked police what employees or customers should do if they witness theft happen right in front of them. They say don't get involved physically. It is just property, although it's very expensive property, but it is just property. They could have violent backgrounds. You know, you could get attacked easily. They could be, have weapons on them. It's just not worth it to try and physically stop them. Just be a good witness. Now, Lieutenant Gomez says police actually arrested the crew on July 12th after the suspects allegedly stole 16,000 bucks worth of merchandise at a Lululemon store in Walnut Creek, but they were later released. Now, if arrested, the suspects could be facing commercial burglary charges as well. Call Crime Stoppers at 498 STOP if you have any tips for police. Live in the studio, Justin Lum, CBS 47 Eyewitness News. Just